baby voices. And before you start, I don't mean the voices of actual babies. I'm not a monster. It's not like I hear a baby and I'm like, Oh, shut up, Emily, you disgusting little baby. I mean the cutesy, lovey, dubby, in the honeymoon period voice that couples do when they're at the cinema on dates. You know, that honey. Yes, honey, honey, bubby, bubby, bee, bee, boo. You know how much I snuggly wubbly love you? Oh, well, I snuggly wubbly doubly love you. Or would you just tickle wickle my belly a little bit? Oh, you mean a little belly down here? I just want you to tickle it just a little bit. You want me to tickle it down here? Oh, yes, I'm tickling a little bit of tickle. Oh, tickling a little belly. I'll tickle you. Oh, tickling you. Yes, I'll tickle your little belly. Oh, yes, you little belly, ooh, little belly. And you're sat behind them like, I'm gonna let this slide during the trailers, but when the film starts, you better shut the f If you're one of these couples who does baby voices in public, I sincerely hope that your relationship crumbles and you die alone. That's a bit harsh, but I hate baby voices. It's just weird. Why, if you wanted someone to fancy you, would you try and impersonate a child. It's weird. It's actually not just the tone of the baby voices, it's even the words themselves. The other day at dinner, I saw a grown man get up from the table and announce, excuse me, I've just got to go to the little boy's room for a piddly pee. It's like, ugh, don't tell us that. Why do we want to know? You're not going to the little boy's room for a piddly pee. You're a grown man. You go to the toilet and you take a piss. And stop calling it the little boy's room. Why would you associate bathrooms with little boys? You don't even have to tell us anything. Just get up and say, excuse me, then come back five minutes later. It's not like the whole table is waiting around going, that's a shame Malcolm didn't tell us what he was doing. Well, we've got no idea if it was a willy woo or a bloppity whippity whoppity. We don't need to know. Stop doing baby voices. Stop doing baby words. If we had it my way, we wouldn't even use baby voices to actual babies. So instead of all this, okay, Emily, open up the station for the children. Choo-choo train, choo-choo-choo-choo. It'd be more like this. Emily, open your mouth, here comes your food. 